Hi guys, so it's Sunday and Kendra and I are about to get ready to order some food and we're gonna use Grubhub. Thanks so much Grubhub for sponsoring this video. We haven't gone grocery shopping yet so that's how we're gonna order some food. And like I said, we're gonna be using Grubhub which is super easy to use. You basically just download the app like I did. It's this red one here. And you basically just order your food. I'm currently waiting for my order. So here it just says that my order is in the works. And we ordered from Taco Mac because we haven't had them in a while and we were just craving habanero wings. Well, we do boneless wings, that's what I got. And then I got regular fries and Kendra always gets hers with sweet potato fries. So Grubhub is really new to Atlanta. So we're super glad that we finally have Grubhub now. And all first time Atlanta diners will get a $10 off a $15 purchase or more. So we will have that coupon code in the description box for you guys to check out if you're an Atlanta native. Right now I'm just having some tea because my throat is feeling a little scratchy. So I'm just having some tea. I'm just drinking green tea ginger mixed with season sampler i think that's the name of it the season sampler kendra got from target i think and it's basically for if you're like feeling like you're getting sick so that's what i mixed it with hello how are you thank you so much so it looks like everything is in the bag here's the taco mat bag here so really convenient they were really fast i wasn't expecting it to be that quick they gave us all our condiments, napkins, everything that we pretty much need. And Grubhub is pretty new to Atlanta, if you guys are wondering. And they always have local places that are near your house. So yeah, this is our food. That's Kelsey's, that's mine. And like I said, they put everything in here that we needed. And those of you in the Atlanta area who live in the Atlanta area, take advantage of the offer that they have going on to get $10 off your purchase of $15 or more. So go to grubhub.com for that. Hi guys, so it's Monday and I'm in the bathroom because I'm about to get ready to trim my hair. And it has a lot of static, but it did grow a lot. Maybe y'all can see that, but it's like at my hip bone. But I'm gonna cut all that off. So it grew about two inches, I guess. I don't really measure my hair just because I just don't keep up with that. Cause I feel like if you obsess over like inches, then you're gonna feel like growing out your hair is a longer process, so I just don't like measure my hair. <sighs> but I'm just about to trim it really quickly. I don't need that much taken off because my hair's pretty healthy and I don't have as many split ends as I thought I would have. From being curly for about six months, I guess. I think that's how long we were curly, which is a very long time. Just because it just, it wasn't really getting cold in Atlanta, so. I didn't see the point of straightening it if it was like still hot. The only thing about when my hair is like freshly done is I have a lot of static, which is really annoying. But I got a dryer sheet to take care of that. I think this is supposed to work. But I've never tried it before, but I read how to get rid of static in your hair and I read dryer sheets work. Okay. This is kind of a weird angle, but you can like really see how much it grew now. So like super duper long. Like extremely long. Like I said, my butt crack. The ends are like thin and I don't really like that stringy look. So I'm gonna get rid of all of that. But um, the clip that you guys probably saw before this was uh, Kendra and I went to an event. Last Thursday, we went to a Jerlique event. Um, Jerlique is a, a skincare brand, but they just recently opened up a spa here in Atlanta at the Intercontinental in Buckhead. So they invited us and it was a really nice event. Um, I've never tried Jerlique products before, but Kendra has. I need to go get my glasses cause I can't, well, I can see, but I wanna make sure I'm like cutting off exactly what I need to. Okay, got my specs. By the way, these are my new glasses. 
they're grandpa glasses but i like how they look but i'm trying to get used to this new prescription because i ain't gonna lie like every time i take these glasses off i get kind of dizzy because i'm trying to get used to this new prescription okay so i'm gonna take all that off that's to go There we go. So I like crispy ends. I don't like stringy ends. Okay, so I didn't even have to cut that much off, but my ends feel so much better. I'm telling you, just taking off like the smallest bit makes the biggest difference. And I think I just cut off maybe like an inch, but it was like stringy. So it was like barely even an inch. So it still looks just as long. It's just like cleaner ends. See? So yeah. So Bobby Brown sent us this package. I just opened this little wallet thing and it has like a travel set of brushes in here, which is so cool. I love this packaging, like the color burgundy like cranberry color is so so pretty and i'm sure these are pretty nice quality brushes because it is bobby brown but i've never even like tried her brushes so i can't wait to try these that big one looks like it's probably really soft yeah it's pretty soft so yeah it's like a little wallet so cool then i just got like this little note here so cool i love this packaging so pretty and then like i have like this little travel like makeup bag also this so let me see what this is so it looks like some of her lipsticks they look a little bit smaller than the regular packaging lipsticks but they're in this pretty gold packaging so i'm gonna have to like go through all those and see what the colors look like this is so nice like i might just take this to travel if i'm gonna be like away for a while look it has like bobby brown here like on the, the zipper this is really nice so let's see okay this packaging though. So there's a highlighter in here. This kind of looks like the packaging that her limited edition bronze glow highlighters came in and then she started doing her like the her regular highlighters to look like this. Like I just love the packaging of this. So pretty. So so this is her highlighting powder in Moon Glow. This packaging is A1 though. Like look how gorgeous that is. Sorry the camera's not focusing so so pretty i'm obsessed with this packaging this is nice so we got a long wear liquid eyeliner it says carbon black yeah long wear liquid liner oh i can't wait to see how that is i've never tried any of her eyeliner so look how nice this is like you can like separate like your stuff and like put like some more brushes in here and then this is the same packaging as the highlighter but this is a little bit bigger these just look like some eyeshadows they're very cool tone but the color in the middle is really pretty. You probably can't really tell. That matte black is nice though. And it's a navy blue at the bottom. That's pretty. So this bottom part has a different kind of packaging in it. These are like a brown. Kind of looks like a, I don't know, like a pleather printed look. Like the vibe of it. So this is really nice. Just a different vibe going on from those two. So here it looks like we have a eyebrow kit. Oh, it's actually not a brow kit. This is a soft, smoky shadow and mascara palette. So that was a mascara and eyeshadows. It looks like brow stuff to me. And this is called her Satin and Caviar Shadow Kit with a brush in there and a gel liner. So that's really nice. So we got another eyeshadow palette here. These are really pretty. Again, a mirror, really good for travel. I'm not going to keep all this. I think I might just separate some of this stuff and include it in our next giveaway and keep some of it, but not keep all of it. Like I'll probably give these three away and also some of these lipsticks. This packaging is so pretty or I might just give like the whole thing away, like all of the lipsticks together. Hey guys, it's Kendra. So um, just in case you guys wanted to see my hair, this is what it looks like. So it's grown a lot from when i cut it well when kelsey cut it a few months ago if you guys want to know more about that go look at my video on how i got my curls back i talked about all about getting it cut there but yeah it grew back pretty much to waist length where it was before i knew that it would grow back to where it was because i've grown my hair out before so yeah so it feels a lot healthier feels you know really good kelsey cut off about an inch 
um, right when I straightened it. So I wanted her to go ahead and cut an inch off. So it was actually even longer than this, but I felt like I needed some cut off. So yeah, I'm just glad it grew back and it's nice and healthy. And I'm gonna try to put less heat on it this season. So when I do wear it straight, I usually do my hair like once every two weeks, but I'm gonna try to stretch it to once every three weeks. So I can have less heat on my hair. So we'll see how that goes. I'm not sure if it's gonna last, but I'm gonna try to make it last, use dry shampoo, you know, do heatless waves, all that kind of stuff, so. So yeah, I'm just really glad that it's healthy and, you know, we're gonna keep it this way. We're in Target. We only had about six things on the list. <laughs> and this is what we have in our cart. So, yeah. Well, if you got a- Unplanned. If you got a basket, I wanna go all that. Don't blame me. Okay, so we just got home. Just gonna do a little random Target haul with all this stuff. Cause I legit had like five things on my list. That's it, just five things. Maybe six, but not all this. Got these Vans Fire Roasted Veggie Gluten Free Crackers. I feel like it's good to have a healthier choice snack when you like snacks like we do. So I just feel like it was necessary to, to try these. Hopefully I like them. Um, they sounded good, like the Fire Roasted Veggie. I feel like they might be similar to the Wheat Thin or like the Triscuit brand things. I feel like they may be similar to the Triscuit, like the tomato roasted or something. I forgot the name of them, but um, hopefully these are good. So got those. Needed some more egg whites. So got these. Sorry about our terrible kitchen lighting. Needed some more silk coconut milk. Love this one. And um, it doesn't matter if we get the unsweetened or sweetened one. I just like these for our smoothie. So um, yeah, love these. These are for Kelsey's coloring book that she got at Five Below like a week ago. And it's like a Zen coloring book, she says, for adults, she says. <laughs> and then I got this Ripple chocolate milk because Kelsey said it was really good. Meditation. Oh my gosh. See, it's an, an adult. Okay, oh, I got it. I got, got you. I believe you now. Okay. <laughs> Uh, so I wanted to try this if I was like craving something sweet. Um, I wonder if this tastes hot like if you have it kind of like hot chocolate if it's good like that. I don't know. But it's dairy free. See how this tastes. And this is also what was actually on the list. Which is tea. We were running out. I got this turmeric tea. I have never tried turmeric tea so I can't wait to try this one. Got some Tazo Zen tea. It is green tea with lemongrass and spearmint. So it's pretty much green tea. I love green tea. So I wanted to try this one. Got this Tazo green ginger. It is ginger tea with a sweet note of pear. So we'll see how that tastes. I got some more of these energy gummies. These are really, really good. The first time I tried these, I think we were at the Mario Masterclass and they were like in the goodie bag. So I decided to buy my own. And then we've got this lemon ginger tea. This is really good. Kind of tastes very holiday. It tastes kind of like a gingerbread cookie, like lemon cookie. It's really weird, but it tastes kind of like a holiday tea. So this one's really good. It's herbal tea. And last but not least for the teas, we got peppermint tea because I like to drink this at night. And this one is caffeine free. So got some of these by drinks. I really wanted to try these just because I just like to have like a beverage option besides water, even though that's literally all I drink. And kombucha, of course, I love kombucha. But this is the Bi Antioxidant Infusion. This is the pomegranate one. And I just got, I think, two of those. And then I also wanted to try this one. This is the Kula Watermelon one. And Kelsey also got one of these in the watermelon. Speaking of kom kombucha, these are mine. Uh, I got the Suja brand. We love their juices, like their green juices. So I got the peach one. I've tried this one before. Got the ginger one. And I got the berry one, which I also tried before. So got these. I really like the Kavita brand um, that they have at Whole Foods. And I like Health Aid from Whole Foods. But this one, I feel like it's new because I haven't seen the Suja brand kombuchas until recently. So got those. Got four mugs. So we were not even supposed to be in the dishes section. So this is so random. Um, but you can never have enough mugs because we love tea and Kelsey talking about putting hot chocolate in it and, and I try not to have hot chocolate because it's full of sugar but in December we do drink hot chocolate a lot so I guess she's right these will be good for that as well but I got them for tea. 
So I got four of those. I like these, I like the handle on them. They're really simple mugs. I need to put those in the dishwasher. And also decided to get some plates because uh, we wanted some more plates to add to the rest of our dishes we already have. We usually get our plates from Home Goods because Home Goods has really good dishes for good prices, but these weren't that bad. I forgot, but I don't think they were too expensive because it's Target, so it was pretty affordable. Um, got these. Kelsey said these would be really good for like uh, pasta meals, and I agree. They're like they're like plate bowls. So yeah, like a hybrid of a plate and a bowl. So got four of those, and then we just got some regular plates, like the square ones, and we got four of those as well. More beverages because we've been obsessed with this Neuro brand beverages. Um, this is the stress one. And it's the white raspberry. It's really good. And I really like this one also. This is the daily health one. And it's the tangerine citrus. Kelsey got this one. It's the tropical lychee trim one. Yeah, as you can see, we love the blue one. And I really love the green one. So that's like my favorite. Kelsey really likes the red energy one. I like the energy one, but the orange flavor. The purple one, they had a lot of the purple one at Target. But I didn't see the orange one, so I didn't get any. And these are the Suji... Suja, I probably just said that so wrong earlier, but these are the Suja juices that we like with the apple, banana, mango, lemon, kale, spinach, spirilla, and chlorella, also barley grass. So we really like this one. They have other green juice options, but this one just tastes the best. I like the other ones. Kelsey hates the one with the celery, but this is the one we like the most. These are mine because I'm obsessed with pomegranates and I just have to have these like for a snack, especially at night because I like to have fruit at night. So I love these. Kelsey says she just thinks they taste like seeds. And they are pomegranate seeds, but I feel like they have a flavor. They have juice in them. So they're really good to me. So I love pomegranates. This is just Kelsey's. This is a spa exfoliating bath cloth. See, random. These are our chips. So this is the better option chips that we like. We like this Cape Cod brand. These are the kettle cooked potato chips and sea salt and vinegar. And I won't be eating those because I don't like salt and vinegar chips. So these are clearly Kelsey's. I do want to try these though. These are the sweet and spicy jalapeno ones from Cape Cod. So I got those. And these are our not that healthy of an option chips. But we still like to have these especially for the weekend. These are Kelsey's Takis. I love Takis. This is the hot chili peppers one in line. Uh, so got some Takis. And then I really love these. Last time I tried them these are the flaming Hot Ruffles. So good. Kelsey said they kind of taste like a knockoff of Sweet Heat, but I still like them. So whatever. Got some heat protectant, Tresemme, OG products, still selling it. Still good. This is bomb. So we each got one because I realized I didn't have any. So I just used a different heat protectant, but I still like to have this one on hand. Got some Progresso Soup. This is just the chicken noodle one. I like to have this if I don't feel like making a meal. So I just put this like on, on the stove. And just heat it up and it's just like a quick lunch or a quick dinner so i love that got some shredded carrots got some baby carrots we usually get these from whole foods or trader joe's but i didn't feel like going so just we were already at target so why not and then kelsey just picked up this spring mix salad so yeah that's it for our random target haul okay guys so i'm just waiting on this video to upload you guys didn't really miss anything yesterday i just did my friend claudia's hair um, I hadn't straightened it in a while because she only comes to me to get it straightened because she doesn't like to straighten it herself. And she likes for me to trim it for her. And her hair had grown so much. Um, I think I just cut off maybe like two inches because it was not as damaged as she thought it would be because she doesn't really do a whole lot to her hair. She's still learning to build a routine and I always get on her about having a routine. So yeah, her hair has grown so much since I started doing it. Um, ever since she started coming to me to get it done because she used to go to a salon to get it done and she just said that her hair wasn't as healthy as it could have been because she used to get relaxers as well like most of us and then she went natural and she started taking me and Kendra's tips about like not using as much heat on it and that's how her hair grew so much. I get so many people like that message me on Snapchat saying that like our tips really do work and you send me pictures and I'm so glad to see that our tips are really working for you guys. I do see those messages on Snapchat when you guys send them to me so thank you. Okay this is almost done. Two minutes remaining. Oh yeah I forgot to show you guys my nails the other day. 
I got French ombre, kind of covered my face. Okay, this camera don't want to focus on my nails. It's like being a pain in the ass, but I got French ombre. I think that's what you call this. And I just got them shorter because this is a new set. So I just told him to make them shorter than I usually get them. Well, this is short for me anyway. Um, but I think eventually I'm going to like take a break from um, fake nails and just like wear my real nails. Sometimes I just want to ball my hands up in the fist without having nails on, you know? But like then when I don't have on nails, I feel like not as feminine. I don't know. I guess I, I guess because I've been getting my nails done for so long. So by the way, how cute is this jacket? Got it from Urban Outfitters maybe like a month ago, I think. Yeah, it's a really cute NASA bomber jacket. And then the inside is red. How cute is that? And then it has pockets. So dope, right? Like I'm obsessed with this jacket. I got it from the men's section because they always have better options. Like people always ask where we get our um, Adidas shirts, like our, a lot of our Adidas shirts and our graphic tees or like um, any like t-shirt that I wear with like a um, artist on it. It's a men's shirt most of the time from Urban Outfitters. Oh, I forgot to show you guys the back. It has like patches on it. So how cute. So yeah, it just has like patches on it. So I just thought it was like a real like unique bomber jacket.